Oh, first off, we pride ourselves on being a very physical football team, and it's very important to us that we can run the football. So I'm glad that we were able to come in today and set the tone on the ground uh, and get that running game uh, back where we expect it to be. You know, offensively and defensively, uh, I thought we played uh, a pretty good game today, but we still aren't peaking. And we talk about every week we want to get better and better, and uh, we want to be playing our best football uh, down the stretch here. Um, you know, in, in the second as we head into the second half of the season. Um, all week, our scout team gave us a great look, and um, as a result, our offensive line opened up the holes that we needed and got us to the got us to the second line of defense. And all of our running backs are capable of making big plays, so we were able to just. The line was just blocking really well, got, gave us green field to run on. We just took advantage of that. Well, the last, last few weeks have been struggling a little bit on the run, so we wanted to come in, ground and pound a little bit, let our up, big guys up front. I mean, we got a lot of big guys up front. We want to let them work, and we have three talented running backs in Malik and Nazir and Aaron Griffin. So we wanted to give those guys a lot of touches today. I mean, we ran for like 250, 300 yards today. So, I mean, our, our O-line did a hell of a job there five big guys that can move and they made a lot of big holes today and running backs to the rest. Um, we, we started off slow, definitely. Um, we wanted to, um, they, they were running a lot of three-step like slants and stuff like that and they were just driving down the field and eventually like, like they, we'd get in the red zone, we'd, we'd stop them, so that was good. But like at the end of the game, we finally started to pick it up and we started to get three and outs and we started to actually make plays and stuff like that. Uh, Kyle did a great job locking down. We had a great, I think, great game on our side. We locked down, so. Coming into the game, we already knew that uh, we shouldn't take this team lightly. We, we shouldn't play the team, play the players. And I felt like we didn't really do that in the first quarter. We were playing the team, not the players. Uh, I feel like we had a, a slow start. We, it took a while for us to wake up. And I feel like the second half, uh, coach said, hey, we got to turn it up. And I feel like that's exactly what we needed. We needed that wake up call because the game felt a little closer than what it was, even though the score wasn't, like, we didn't feel like we were playing to our, our potential. So I just feel like that, that little conversation that we had at halftime really got us up and going and that's what brought us out the intensity. Um, Millgate helped us out a lot, AJ, Luis Ortega, Eric Graham. We had a, we had a great game defensively, but we should, we should do better. We gotta come out with a great intensity every game. We can't, we can't just be second, a second half team. We have to come out with that intensity every game. Homecoming in Alfred University is awesome. I mean, the crowd that was there today was great, uh, and it was great to see a ton of alumni back. And, uh, um, you know, one of our honorary captains was uh, Hall of Fame inductee Brenton Brady, and having him back on campus here and back on our sidelines uh, was pretty special. Um, so, uh, a great day today uh, for Alfred University homecoming.